Okay, welcome back everyone. This is of course Eric Malkavian with your Hull City Tigers. Now if you remember our last exciting matchup, we defeated Chelsea 6-5 to five in the Barclay, I'm sorry, in the Capital One. So, our next match is against West Ham, who we've been beating back and forth. Mohamed Diame to again face his former club, West Ham. Now, we're going to send this match. I've already played West Ham twice and, and beat the hell out of them. So what we're going to do is we're going to send that match. Okay, so that was the first leg of the Capital One Cup. Okay, what's wrong with Ndoye? Diame Ndoye right to be one of the first names on Team Sheet in doubt with the player in such a poor poor run of form. Needs to knuckle down and train. Get back to basics. Prove that he's worthy of a place in the team. Oh, who in the heck wrote that? I didn't. Aston Villa. I don't care about this stuff. Top goal score. This is old news. Yeah, that was um, prior to my uh, resigning. Let's take a look at. Okay, so that was my. Uh, select. That hasn't really updated. Right, okay, let's see now. Let's go back. It's been a while since I played. So I want to go into the office. I know there are a few signings I need to make. There was Suni. We're going to let him go. He's an own goal scorer. And he just basically sucks. Um, I don't know. I think Harper turned down my offer. Let's see. So... Figaro is a good left back. He's usually starting. So. Yeah, he's a good player. Um, I think if I play him more, he'll he'll be even better. All right, so uh, all right, so let's offer him a new contract. Uh, okay. Luca, okay. Turns all right. This guy doesn't even play. He's a left back that hardly ever plays. He's this guy's gone. Um. So he won his uh role defined. All right. I guess he's a he's a sporadic first team player. Um, Gives a clean sheet. Yeah, we'll give a bonus. Uh, yeah. All right, see what he says. Let's see here. Our model's thin. Wow. <laughs> he gets 60 grand. He's a good player. We'll, uh, we'll revisit him. Sackbolt accept my contract. 
And I signed Nico Yell Al Yelovich. He's uh Uh, yeah, he's already signed, so. Okay, so as I said, we're going to, let's take a look at the, sch the schedule. Currently, let's take a look at the tables. I am sitting at the top of the tables with 46 points. So we got 18 more points left in the season. Um, I guess 18 more games. Alright, so. Let's see. Better yet, let's take a look at the calendar. So we're at West Ham. Then we have the other leg of the Chelsea game. So let's go to this match. Um, we're going to sim this match, um, uh, who do we want to play for this match? Right, so, I see, let me set my squad up and I will be right back. right back okay so here's our team for the sim match let's go see how it turned out alright so you know what we're gonna play it I could use a little practice <laughs> Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Barclays Premier League. It's West Ham United against Hull City. So midway through the season and they're top of the table, they need to keep on winning. Can they do that? Let's head off to East London and the Berlin ground, the famous home of West Ham United. Conditions are absolutely fantastic. Clear blue skies. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. He's enduring a sticky spell at the moment, but they're asking him to play his way through it, Alan. I'm surprised at that. I really thought that the manager would give him a little rest to, to watch on from the sidelines, but no. No. Um, I think he figured out... Two changes for West Ham today. Adrian starts in goal. James Tompkins replaces James Collins, who's suspended. Alex Song starts looking to recover his four. In attack, Andy Carroll starts. He was man of the match last time out. So here we are. We've got the East whole City team here for you. Steve Harper starts in goal. James Chester plays with Curtis Davis in central defence. David Myler plays with Mohamed Diame in the centre of the pitch. In attack, Yannick Sagro starts. He's been in tremendous form recently. Hull City, how will they fare in this game? Well, the way this manager has led this team to do better than we all thought, I think there might be one or two other clubs looking at him and trying to poach him come the end of the season. Well, we've got a, a battle within the war today, haven't we, with the player getting his track at his old teammates? Yeah, and I think it's always an emotional time when you face your former club, so you just want to concentrate on doing himself justice. Mike Dean is the referee. We're just going to try to play a basic game here. Great to get the game underway through West Ham's kicker.
West Ham United have given a corner. <laughs> Played a little friendly before this, but uh, even though I recently updated some. Uh, Goalkeeper wanted it really, that's not the best idea. Right in quickly to try and win the ball back. Aluko tries his luck, that's a great block. Referee has pointed for a corner. This is a pretty good kick. Oh, did you see the hand pop? Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, that looked like a handball to me. Brilliant opening, in with the chance. Keeper's done very well here. Well, they've got a corner. Trying to be more tentative when I'm shooting because I'm shooting a lot of shots over the bar. Mohamed Diame. Oh, too hard. I passed that way too hard. I don't know whether the visitors will be being G'd up by their manager, not to take this one lightly, but it was a pretty comfortable win. They had the superiority on their own ground, but you know, football is strange the game. This could be a chance. He shoots. Not a decisive save. David Myler. Aluko. Is a uh, simple interception. Down it. Stopping the pass getting through with a good piece of anticipation. Valencia. Sheku Kuyate. Carroll. They've linked up well. Now he's lost the ball. Good forward play from them. Challenges for the ball. Oh that, uh, the flag is up. It has gone out off the player. Alan, what do you think about his form recently? Been struggling, hasn't he? It's not the kind of form that we've become accustomed to with East Lad. I don't know what's going on. the shot well play blocked it possession in the midfield area Sagbo this is going to be a throw and in it comes quickly with the throw in the ah. interception there was key really to the side that's having to defend at the moment it's a challenge for Hull City no one's disputing that, but if they work hard at their game, they've got every chance of getting the result that they want. Undoya. asserting his authority here early on giving that free kick I'm not sure why he called a free kick there <laughs> all I did was block it well, it's easy here for the keeper the 
and Doyer. Ah, a timely challenge. That's a bad one. Mino Figueroa. And here's the shot. Excellent block by the defender. It's a chance. Got to be. Well, there's the goal. Now, what about the celebration against his old club? Muhammad yeah, Dayami. Something about how he regards he plays so his, his well against West Ham. He really does. And if you <laughs> miss that, you look a little bit foolish, but he's turned the bottom left with a plump. Yeah, that was a great play. And that's a goal well worth analysing again. I'm not blowing my own horn there. Um, I didn't mean to be arrogant. <laughs> it's just a good play by the uh, the player. All right, let's go. Well, here we are, 12 minutes into the match. Excuse me. And that is the first goal. Cresswell. Attacking oh. well here. Um, this looks promising until that challenge. And now the opposition are away. Sheko Kuyate. That's a fine tackle. Really? Down it. Valencia. That's a real tussle for the ball. Good control here. Quite congested midfield, but good passing from this team. Sagbo. I think the referee's showing how he's going to officiate this match. He's going to be a free kick. He's not going to stand any nonsense. I wonder how he's feeling scoring against his old club, Alan. Well, it happens so often, doesn't it, when a player's really pumped up to, to do well against his former club. He's certainly done well here. Mark Noble. Sagbo. with the deflection. Mino Figueroa. Takes the shot off. Oh, got in the way. Great block. Just squeeze in another look at that goal, Alan. Well, that's wonderful, isn't it? Because uh, he had an awful lot of work to do to beat the keeper from that distance. going well here's the chance Ooh. they've still got an opportunity here after the goalkeeper parried it David Myler this team really on top of their game and they've got themselves to be top of the league by playing like this. Yeah, they have. I mean, they've got some top players, haven't they? Let's face it. These guys are ridiculous, football. yeah. Valencia. Mark Noble. Gresswell. On to the attack now. A touch off the player and out. What a 
play a hacking type of game. Mark Noble. Mohamed Diame. He might be through. In with a chance. Oh. Well held by the goalkeeper. Poor run, really, isn't it, for the home team? Two points in the last five league games. Yeah, it's been disappointing. It's been poor, actually, and uh, the manager might be scratching his head. Downing. Oh. Well, he has a go. Got good hands, this goalkeeper. That's a good save. I just gave him a signing. Aluko. He's into the challenge. Cresswell. Sagbo. Mohamed Diame. Oh. Noble. Carroll. Mark Noble. Demel quickly back to his feet. Andy Carroll. Sagbo. Aluko. Downing. Carroll. in the way there and he's deflected the ball out of play. One step. Okay, so let's continue play. Mohamed Diame. Challenged quickly by the opposition. It's good vision to be able to switch the play there. He's cleaned up here, hasn't he, with that clearance. Mohamed Diame. David Myler. Aluko. Well done. Bundoya. Brilliant opening. Got to be. Oh, that's what we've come to see. That's a brilliant goal. Oh, yeah. And the way he's hit this one, he's flew off his boot to beat the keeper. Bam! Coming up another look at it, Alan. That will show us something. <clears throat> Have the right touch on the shot. Oh, well, that's that's it. made it 2 0. Valencia. Oh, he loves that, doesn't he? And it's come off for him again. Song. Shoot. Andy Carroll makes the challenge here. Sagbo. In came the tackle, but the player couldn't be stopped. Ah, uh, darn it. He goes for goal. Still a chance after that save. The uh, <sighs> yeah. pass has fizzled out here. Goal kick. Can we have another look at the goal? Yes. 
Yeah, maybe giving the keeper a chance with the height of the shot, but it was enough to beat him. Mohamed Diame. And the shot's on! Good chance, wasn't it? Ooh. That just sums up his form. He's really been in a shocking spell when he can't do anything right, and he couldn't there either with that miss-hit shot. Oh, I, didn't, I hit it too hard. It really wasn't his fault. I thought I would have to hit it. Oh, time to get the cross now. The chance to play on by the referee. In goes the cross. The chance for the wide man to make some progress here. There's the ball in. Oh, he scored. And what a first season he's having. Yeah, oh, just crap. a moment for him. <laughs> Might be a big goal in this That was my fault. That was my fault. <laughs> Just grasping that thin air. What a header to find the top right. Oh, it's all worth looking at again, isn't it? I tried to get to the ball with that player, and I didn't make it. And yeah, he's really here, good. But that's no excuse. Undoya. Oh, I just missed it with Diame. Uh, so important for the modern day. I was trying to give it a one. A good starting position and to act as the, as the sweeper for that back four. Oh, that was bad. To the right, that's where the options are. Wow, that guy that's hacked the hell out of me. Here. That should be a card. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> uh, I hacked the hell out of me. Yeah, his teammates looking around as if to say, well, we can't afford for him to leave the pitch. That was an easy decision for the ref. I mean, look at this. In. It's a reckless one. really but they've won eight in that will be a free kick against West Ham yeah I mean the guy just dove in right there Red card. yeah he got now oh. behind on both counts number of players and number of goals yeah they already had a, a mountain to climb but with a man less well mm -hmm. it's almost impossible well that's risky going in like that look at this what it is he saw the ball and he thought he could win it but just as fraction off Yeah, I mean, it's just... Mohamed Diame. Davis. Oh, fabulous clearance. Aluko. Oh, man. He's gone for goal. They've still got an opportunity here after the goalkeeper parried it. On the wrong side of the field. Sagbo. Undoya. That's a very crisp challenge there. He shoots. Excellent block by the defender. Valencia. Pass back. That's lovely. And that tackle has got him the ball. <sighs> Valencia. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Oh, darn it. Downing. That's an advantage for West Ham. Valencia. Tackling is a real skill. Undoya. No. Oh. 
Sagbo. Goodness, they needed him then to clear that. Undoya. Downing. <sighs> and he's got the ball well to set his team on the front foot by intercepting. Downing. Valencia. About this Valencia. And the booking now will be completed. The referee's come back to the offender. Yeah, he had uh, eyes in the back of his head there almost. He what saw it at the corner for? of his eye and he made sure he went back to it. Mark Noble. Well, this attack got a bit of menace to it. Ah, oh, darn. Hamid Yame. Undoya. David Myler. The goalkeeper not needed because they've stopped the shot. And now they've got a corner on the attack again. The team that's leading by one goal. Well, that's a fantastic clearance. He rose to the occasion. And save the day. Aluko. And the shot's off. Goalkeeper in the firing line. Ooh. A blockbuster of a shot. With this That's... goal advantage, they've now got a corner. Good shot. Kuyate. Ah. Noble and the referee hit by the ball, I think, to be fair to him, the ball hit him. Valencia. Sagbo. Chance for it. Got to be. Taken full advantage. With a goal. It's always nice to see a team make use of that advantage by playing football and making use of the extra man. And he was the calmest man in the stadium there to place it to the keeper's right. And that's a goal well worth analysing again. Yeah, he just beat him. <laughs> And it's 3-1. The goals keep on coming. And Reed. Well, the board has gone up to show five minutes of added time. Mohamed Diame. Undoya. Is that what I did? What do you think about West Ham's next game? Well, they're playing Swansea City in the next match in the Barclays Premier League. Yeah. Do you know what, Martin? I think it's going to be tough for them. Is that what I did? Sheikho Kuyate. And it's Demel. No wasting time here. Oh, Shaku Kuyate. Brilliant technique in the tackle. David Myler. What a chance here. Not a decisive save. That's really well done. Good defending. 
Sagbo. Ah. Valencia. Demel. Sheko Kuyate. Mohamed Diame. Half time and 3 1 is the score at the break. Well, here we are at half time, and it's a bit of a stunned atmosphere around the ground because that goal one down was bad enough for the home fans. Now it's two just before half time. Yeah, an important team talk for the home manager, but uh, he needs his players to be big to volunteer for the ball, and they've still got a chance in this match. Okay. So we reach half time with the score 3 1. Let's take a look at the highlights from that first half. And then we'll be straight back to your commentary team for the rest of the game. We'll go past that. Here's the uh, scores around the Barclays Premiership. All right, there's the match facts. Mm. We're leaving Doya in there. Um, yeah, me. Everything set for the second half. I'd like to get him going. Was done well. nice clean that was a save. bad shot. <laughs> I meant to pass it. As I said, I haven't played in a couple years, even though I've been uploading here recently. Mohamed Diame. annoying for the coach to see that throw in breakdown oh, like that. I didn't see that. I mean, I meant to, I was trying to get it to David Myler. Sagbo. Well read by the defender to intercept. Undoya. Sagbo. And here's the shot. He's reached it, but I don't know how. Opportunity here. Here's the chance. It's another chance that's gone begging here. Oh, wow. I thought that was going in, man. Kuyate, Valencia, Downing. Figueroa. On EA Sports, coming soon, the English League Cup fixture. Hull City, and Chelsea. Chelsea away right. from home. Yeah, a lot of people have been talking about this one. Looking forward to it. Right, Valencia. we have the other leg of the Chelsea semi-finals. Interception there was oh, key, really. To tried to thread the needle there. The moment. Andy Carroll. Sheku Kuyate. Great tackling technique to win the ball cleanly. It's going to be a throw here. The 
shot. Excellent block by the defender. Free kick awarded against Hull. Really? He's made his ruling. He's given the free kick against Hull and he's booked their player. I think it's a fair decision. Really? He just straight ran over me. Genuine attempt to go for the ball. He just didn't seem to get his balance right there. It was a clumsy I don't understand. challenge. This guy just completely ran me over. <sighs> David Myla. Enjoy it. In a goal, in with a chance. He has done it again. That's two against his former club. What a response, and the manager of his old club might get a bit of stick. Yeah, I bet he does. He's a good player, man. I, I like controlling Diame. He's a well, good player. Keeper, he is just flat-footed, and he can only He makes good that. passes. First time. I don't see why Another they gave up. Peek at that goal. I, I mean, I haven't had any problem with him playing him. in this one-sided match. Downing. Sheikou Kuyate. Well held by the goalkeeper. Good strong tackle. Sagbo. Mohamed Diame. Brilliant opening. And hits it. Good stop by the wow. goalkeeper. Well, they're keeping the pressure on with all these corners. I thought that was going to be a goal. Yeah, that was a good shot. A check on the corner count. for a throw. Sheikou Kuyate. Gresswell. This could be a chance. That's how to tackle. That's a penalty kick. That's a penalty. It had to be. And that's a card. The referee's reaching for a yeah, card. he's it's gone. A one, having given the penalty... Yes, that was inevitable. I think so, Martin. Yeah. No choice whatsoever, given the, the current laws. And, uh, yeah, it's all gone wrong for the team. Mm. Good luck. I can go death out of me, kid. Well, this is very odd. The losing manager he must be changing the whole shape of the team because he's yeah. another player, but he's a defender. I can't believe that. A couple of strikers on the bench. I just wonder what he's thinking. season you do get an opportunity to get the match ball but that was certainly one of them wow that was ugly Go! 
goes for goal. Wow. Very good defending to get in the way of that shot. Brilliant football from this team. That's a clever part of football, isn't it? To back heel the ball like that. And he goes for goal. Well, kept the shot out. It's still in play. Sagbo. That's top, top tackling. And he's really strong in that area. Sheku Kuyate. Came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. Tried to play it through, cut out by the opposition. That's a goal Will kick. Go out of play. You can see it clearly has done. Two against his old teammates now. Apparently played well against uh, his old team here, as he played well for that former team in years gone by. Mohamed Diame. Sagbo. David Myler. Well, he has a go, just over. Golly. Downing. This is an excellent run. Noble. Mark Noble. Kuyate. James Chester. Undoya. Oh. I need to try and get the ball back now. Oh. I screwed that up. Found it. Chance for the cross. Luca. Sagbo. Undoya. Now a throw in. David Myler. He's on the attack and he's got plenty of options from his teammates. And the shot's off. Excellent block. And it's back for another corner. Try to get him the hat trick. Try to get him the hat trick. David Myler. Shots on here. Still a chance after that save. And here's the shot. Dives away the keeper to keep it out. Oh, that's a penalty. Mohamed Diame. What a chance here, and he shoots. Well, that should do him an awful lot of good, Martin, because he's been in poor form. Woo! All right, we'll get him out of here now. And he'll have enjoyed that. I don't think he scored many better. The composure to place it to the left. Different angle on it here. 
Okay, let's go to the substitutions now. And let's see, uh, Luko. Let's get um. Let's see the replay now. Just to recap the scoreline, just take a look at that. Comes in strongly. Ramirez. Sheku Kuyate. It's a take out David Meyer too. And it's Demel. Downing. Throw in now. Gaston Ramirez. Mohamed Diame. Hernandez. Ah, oh, drat. Gaston Ramirez. Sagbo. Good strong tackle. And here's the shot. Safe hands from the keeper from that oh, shot. That was a bad shot. <sighs> That's gone out for a throw in. Mino Figueroa. Hernandez. Gaston Ramirez. Came in with a challenge. Good judgment there to make that interception and clear the ball away. Sagbo. Excellent work from the keeper. Good shot. We'll nice shot, Ab Abel. Good shot. That was a good hard shot. Good hard shot. And the shot's on. It is corner after corner. <laughs> He was really close, man. Ah, uh, that was my fault. Play by the goalkeeper. He's cleaned up here, hasn't he, with that clearance? Gaston Ramirez. And in he goes with the tackle. Now that's a throw. We are going to see a substitution now. All right, let's make a final substitution. Get David Myler out of there. Um, yeah, I want to save uh,
I get Diame that final hat trick. Gotta get in the hat trick. Now we're going to have an alteration. I don't, Dave, I have David Myler run around so much. I don't quite know how Hull City have done this. All the form guys suggested that they, well, well, they would be pushed to win the game. But win it, they're absolutely cantering away with it. Fantastic for Hull. Fabulous clearance. Diame. He's got some skill, this lad. Mark Noble. Gaston Ramirez. He stumbled a bit there, but has managed to stay on his feet. Morgan Amalfitano. It's been the way his game has gone today. His passing's been spot on. Abel Hernandez. Ah. Uh, the interception there was key, well, really, to the side that's having to defend at the moment. 5 1 here, and that's almost that. But what does this mean for their next game? Well, Hull City go up against Chelsea. They've certainly done the job out here, and I'd be confident to doing it again in the next one. Ramirez. Hernandez. Good handling of the shot oh. by the goalkeeper. I meant to pass it to Diame, but... <sighs> Mohamed Diame. He'll need to try and get the ball back now. Great chance. And here's the shot. And the goalkeeper Damn it. has done well to stop that one. How many saves he made against Diame? <clears throat> what about him? And he's uh, just seems devoid of confidence at the moment. He's going through a bad spell and he can't seem to get out of it. Oh, worth the try. Looks great when they do come off. Ah. Robert Snodgrass. Gaston Ramirez. And he's dispossessed. Pass back. That's lovely. To O'Brien. It's going to be his oh, job here. Screw up. Sagbo. Ramirez. To the rescue again. And it will be their throw. Very confident to get the game moving again. Great opportunity. He shoots. The red card has come back to haunt the team that's just conceded. Yeah, and sometimes it invigorates a team that gets a man sent off, but that's not been the case here. He's got a good left foot. That's his foot. This is a lefty, so that's his good foot. <sighs> yeah, I beat these guys so bad. And what a finish this was. Really did put his boot through it to find the left-hand side. Well, let's take another look at the goal. All right. So that's on, currently playing on world class. Well, this is a scoreline that'll Excuse make some me. headlines. 6-1. Downing. Carroll.
Gaston Ramirez. And he takes the shot. Excellent block by the defender. Sagbo. That is a tackle and a half. Pushed back into play by the goalkeeper. That's really the way to get the ball. I just can't not get a goal in with the Mohamed Diame. Mino Figueroa. Robert Snodgrass. Well, that's it. Well, he has a go. He's wow. reached it, but I don't know how. James Chester, Mohamed Diame. He times his tackle superbly. Sagbo. Morgan Amalfitano. Andy Carroll. But Snodgrass. Oh, that's got to be a penalty. Mark Noble. Robert Snodgrass. Mohamed Diame. back for a corner again <sighs> stage is yours Alan Ramirez's goal well, he's got a fair bit to do from that distance but he's placed it really well to the keepers right In between these two teams, reflected on the scoreline, 6 1 the final score. You don't often get such a one sided match at this level of the game, but that's what we've seen, Alan. Well, we have, and uh, credit to the players out there for playing so well and for dominating it right from start to finish. Okay. Well, there was only really one team in that game, and the away fans will be travelling home delighted with their big win. I'll leave you with the full match highlights, and until next time. I've been Jeff Stelling. That's your whole set of your tigers, baby. Traveling back to Hull with the victory. And they've got in to score here. It's Mohamed Diame again against his old team, the West Ham Hammers. And he's put it away beautifully. Yeah, he just really lit them up. All right. So... 43 shots, a lot of them off target, but 29 big shots on target. All right, let's take a look at things. So, yeah, West Ham, two red cards, a whole, not too many fouls, but um, let's look at the match play ratings. 
Man of the match was Sagbo. So two goals, two goals, two goals. All right. The Barclays so. Premier League. Aston Villa, nil. Liverpool, one. Burnley, nil. Crystal Palace, two. Everton, one. West Bromwich Albion, two. Manchester City, two. Arsenal, one. Newcastle United, one. Southampton, two. Queen's Park Rangers, one. Manchester United, two. Tottenham Hotspur, four. Sunderland, two. Swansea City, nil. Chelsea, two. West Ham United, one. Hull City, six. Now let's see what effect that's had on the league standings. At the top of the table remain Hull City with 49 points. In second, Manchester United with 46 points. In third, Chelsea with 45 points. In fourth, Newcastle United with 35 points. In fifth, Arsenal with 34 points. In sixth, Manchester City with 33 points. In 7th, Queen's Park Rangers with 29 points. In 8th, Everton with 28 points. Bottom of the table, Leicester City with 14 points, with a game in hand on the team above. And then reading up the table, 2nd bottom, Burnley with 15 points. 3rd bottom, Sunderland with 18 points. 4th bottom and falling are Swansea City with 22 points, but only behind on goal difference. Fifth bottom, moving down, are West Ham United with 22 points. Okay, so there we have it. And here in the news is about our winning streak. The league leaders marched impressively on by collecting three more points against their bottom half of the table opponents. West Ham was never, were never really in contention in this game. And Hull City continued their stay at the top of the tables. With this win, West Ham sees their second league loss, second league loss to Hull City this year. They didn't surprise us with anything. Began an unapologetic Sam Allardyce, Allardyce, but we fell into the same traps. That's what cost us. Playing away to your old team is always going to result in a lot of hostility from the fans. This game was no different. However, despite having a tour time of it. Mohamed Diame enjoyed the match, saying, I really enjoyed coming back to the stadium. The fans' reception may not have been great overall, but there were definitely some pockets of fans who showed me some love. It was also good to see... Whoops. Um, okay, here we are. Right. Good to see the West Ham guys again. Of course, my old boss. Fixture ended in a win for Diame in Hull City. As the team celebrated, central midfielder Mohamed Diame was reluctant to get too involved, presumably out of respect for his former club. He chose instead to console his former teammates, talking to them at length about things we can only speculate on. Hull City fans will be happy to see their winning ways continue with this good victory against West Ham. Now, Referee card happy in West Ham versus Hull City clash. It was a fiery fear that the referee did well to keep control of, causing him to brandish his red card more than once. Zen Allardyce said after the game, It got a bit tasty out there, didn't it? Not sure why it went that way today, but there were a lot of uh, um, fouls early on and then some snowballs from there. He continued. Malkavian suggested that Alex, uh, Alex Dre, Song, and Aaron Cresswell both deserved to go. The challenges were reckless, and, and it's not acceptable. There was also a game of football. <laughs> Old City defeated West Ham by 1-6. to six. Okay, well, we will be back very shortly with the Chelsea match in the bark in the... In the, um... Capital One Cup. So I want to thank you for watching. Of course, I'm Eric Malkavian. I've been playing FIFA 15. Manager's mode. Take care.